Among the other quality improvements that we're putting to 12.2, which we'll talk about in a moment, we've uh, focused on debugger quality. There are several improvements in the various RAD Studio debuggers, and the Delphi debugger now handles repeated inline variables with the same name, which was a problem before. We've also improved the debugger error handling and the remote debugger's communication timeouts. We're focusing on quality, and these are the kind of quality of life improvements, but just general quality improvements we put into 12.2. Uh, for Delphi LSP quality, uh, before we jump into what we have done for 12.2, uh, I would like to share that the team is very committed in bringing uh, code completion, code navigation, and code formatting to the highest standard possible. Uh, we are putting our focus in mainly into those three areas uh, for LSP. Uh, this version for 12.2, we, we had a lot in our hands with the 64-bit version uh, of LSP but we didn't want to leave uh, any of these uh, areas untouched so we have made a few improvements uh, where for example now symbol ints uh, will work uh, in the class interface including fields uh, overing over local constants and variables will now resolve their definitions and uh, the angel will now be able to also resolve forward type declarations uh, probably in most cases, but at the moment not in, not in all cases. Uh, the team uh, is very happy also to share that uh, we have done some internal tools that will help us identify uh, problems with the LSP and to help identify regressions uh, before we put them live. So we are very focused uh, on trying to bring LSP to the highest centers possible and uh, I hope that everyone um, will be able to enjoy what, what, we'll, what we'll do uh, and what we have done so far. Over to Marco now. Thanks, Nuno. Let me finish by going over a few additional quality areas in Rust Studio 12.2. For the Delphi RTL, besides addressing some quality tickets, we've added three small new features. There is a new parallel array class that allows you to do parallel operations like sorting on an array. This can make sorting two or three times faster. There's a new t-order dictionary and there is support for the regnon type in the registry. That's a key with no type. That's a feature of the Windows API that is now surfaced in the t-registry class. For VCL, the main focus was on quality work around frame scaling, around the new forms top bar component introduced in 12.0, styling issues and high DPI issues. The work was quite extensive and we're very happy of the outcome. Notice that some of these improvements also positively affect the IDE, which is using the VCL with styling and high DPI. For FireMonkey, we did the work on Android deployment as mentioned earlier. Also a lot of quality work in many areas. Main focus still T-Aided and memo controls on mobile. We have refactored them for desktop and now also for mobile across the various 12X releases. So lots of work happening in FireMonkey to improve the quality and stability of the library across all supported platforms. Talking about Rust Server, there is one significant improvement, which is the web Stances integration. Uh, Rat Server was mainly focused on web service development. Now you can do web development with Rat Server. We have reworked the push notification supporting Firebase for both iOS and Android. This requires support for HTTP2 that was missing. Notice that to enable it on Windows, you need to use libcurl and not the native Windows library. We've also worked a lot in improving the Swagger documentation, the API documentation that's automatically generated by Rust server in terms of providing customization of some of the metadata, filtering of the APIs you want to document, support for YAML in addition to JSON, and also enable the use of multi-line string literals in some of the attributes. With that, I want to highlight the fact that Quality overall took a lot of focus and attention, despite this webinar was focused primarily on the new features added. We addressed approximately 350 customer reported issues across the various subsystems. We implemented almost 30 feature requests. These are tickets that have been reported on the old or the new 
quality portal for customers. And in terms of focus areas, the larger number of tickets was addressed in the IDE, uh, VCL and FireMonkey. We also addressed a number in the C++ and Delphi compilers and in the Delphi runtime library.